Local 4 News starts now with a breaking news alert. And we begin with breaking news from downtown Detroit, where one person has been shot not far from where tonight's tree lighting was taking place at Campus Mark Marshes. Our Mara McDonald is live at the scene tonight near Michigan Avenue in Griswold. And Mara, you just got an update from police from uh, the chief. What did he have to say? Jace, we just talked to him two minutes ago. Take a walk with me. I want to tell you what they're dealing with right now. We've got essentially two different shooting scenes. This is Michigan and Griswold. I mean, for everybody who comes down, this is right by the Coney Islands. You see how close it is to Campus Martius. The chief is telling us that you had two groups of teenagers down here that got into some kind of argument and shots were fired, striking a 15-year-old in the neck. Chief telling us that he is in critical condition right now at Children's Hospital. Now, you can see that police have blanketed this entire area, but this is not the only area that they are at. After the shooting happens here at Michigan and Griswold, across campus marshes heading towards Greektown near the Buffalo Wild Wings, you have another shooting of another young person, condition unknown at this point. The chief says at this point, his officers believe that both of these are related. Whether it is the same shooter or not is unclear, but you have a 15 year old who is in critical condition shot in the neck. You have another young person across campus marshes heading towards Greektown who was shot as well, condition unknown. Now, this happened well, well after the tree lighting down here. So the, the main event down here was over. Police telling us this happened probably right before 10 o'clock tonight. Chief says their criminal intelligence unit is going through all the cameras throughout this entire area. They believe they've got some pretty decent, what he refers to as video assets. He thinks they're gonna have a picture of the suspect in this case up probably tonight. So stand by, Jason and Kimberly. As soon as we know more, we will, of course, come back to you live. We are live in downtown Detroit. Oh, stand by. I understand that we've got some of the chief. Stand by. Take a listen. A bunch of kids uh, hanging out downtown. Uh, one group of kids gets into it, another group of kids. Uh, we've got shots fired, unfortunately. Uh, we've got a 15-year-old that's been struck uh, in the neck. Uh, he's in critical condition at a local hospital. Now, we're going to be checking our video assets and uh, interviewing witnesses. Uh, but, you know, a lot of kids in the area, uh, and it, it's unfortunate that they have to uh, bring guns uh, downtown, and uh, well, we should all be having a good time. Back here live, the chief also saying tonight, do parents realize that they're you know, teenagers, 15, 16 years old, are down here after curfew, after hours. Chief said if he sees and his officers see kids randomly wandering around here without a parent or a guardian, they are going to be picked up. So it is, um, it's a little tense down here right now. We've got two different shooting scenes. Police are working both. They think they're going to have a picture of at least one of the suspects in this probably later tonight. We're live downtown. Back to you. Yeah, and again, this happening well after that tree lighting, but nonetheless, a lot of people still in the area because of everything that's going on tonight. And again, one person, one 15-year-old shot uh, near Campus Marshes. All right, we appreciate your live reporting tonight, Mara.